2023 is set to be the warmest year on record and the world is facing unprecedented challenges. From floods in Libya to wildfires in Greece, the devastating effects of climate change are becoming more and more clear. Muslim-led charities, like many others, are on the ground, helping those caught in the disaster and fighting against a rising tide of poverty. From essential crops destroyed to homes demolished and swept away, the world's most vulnerable people are suffering. COP28 arrives at a critical moment and we're calling for meaningful progress in three key areas. First, we are urging world leaders to confront the climate emergency at its core by committing to phasing out all CO2 emitting fossil fuels and tripling global renewable energy capacity. Immediate and decisive action is vital to protect the planet and the most vulnerable from the worst impacts of the climate crisis. Secondly, while we've witnessed positive developments in climate finance with an increasing number of nations pledging support for the world's poorest in their efforts to mitigate and adapt to climate change as well as address loss and damage, the current level of global climate spending is not nearly enough. We are urging world governments to deliver on their long overdue promises and increase climate finance for the world's most vulnerable populations. Finally, we are calling on the UK government to boost its climate efforts and show greater leadership on the international stage, especially considering their recent decisions to weaken key net zero policies. As we stand united in our call to action, let's remember that as Muslims, we bear a special obligation to use our voices to protect the earth and stand up against climate injustice. Join us in this vital mission towards a just and sustainable future. Together, let's make a meaningful impact for the well-being of our planet and generations to come.